Hey, Dr. Mark Testa here. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about the thing your mother always said, eat your vegetables, very, very important. Now, I know some would say not, but I'm gonna show you why cruciferous vegetables, broccoli, cabbage, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, in that family can be very beneficial for both men and women in reducing the load of estrogen and helping excrete estrogen. Now, broccoli has chemicals in it, uh, sulfur-related chemicals, that can help prevent testosterone turning into estrogen by this intermediary step of an enzyme called aromatase. Aromatase converts testosterone into estrogen. And aromatase is released from fat cells. So the more fat you have in the body, the more aromatase and the more likelihood you're going to convert that testosterone into estrogen. Now that's not good for men because it can give you a loss of libido. It can give you loss of muscle mass. It can cause erectile dysfunction. It can cause moodiness, sleep problems, things that most men don't think about as too much estrogen. But it could be happening in our body as a male if we are a little bit overweight. And right now, CDC just came out and said 42% of Americans are obese, not just overweight, but obese. And so that extra fat is converting testosterone into estrogen. And maybe this is why we see more erectile dysfunction or difficulty with child um, uh, with fertility in men could play a role in this. Also, there's extra xenoestrogens coming into the body from our environment, from plastics and, and things that are in our food supplies that are also putting too much estrogen into a male's body, causing a similar problem. Now, in women, too much estrogen isn't good either. It can increase the risk for uh, estrogen-related cancers, breast cancers, uterine cancers, uh, things of this nature that are overstimulated by too much estrogen. It can cause PMS, cyclical acne, migraine headaches. And so by eating these vegetables in men, broccoli can help prevent the conversion of testosterone into estrogen because it's an aromatase inhibitor. And in both sexes, there are chemicals found in broccoli, such as indole-3-carbonyl or diindole-methane, DIM, that help the liver to detoxify estrogen and get it out of the body faster. So by eating these cruciferous vegetables, broccoli, cabbage, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, garlic and onions, the body can prevent conversion of testosterone into estrogen and in a man, ma male, that's not ideal and in both sexes help get it out of the body quickly. So by consuming these foods, you are benefiting in hormone regulation, uh, pro, you know, maintaining healthy hormone levels. So easy to do. Uh, these vegetables also feed our gut microbiome, which can be beneficial also in detoxification in our body. So many, many benefits here. Now there's one last thing along the broccoli uh, lineage called um, the isothiocyanates uh, that come from broccoli sprouts. Now you can sprout these things in your house in about four or five days, I do it all the time and then just consume them in a smoothie or eat them in a salad. I freeze them first, it, it, it liberates that chemical uh, isothiocyanates and makes it a little more absorbable in the body, but can also uh, in, uh, enhance liver um, detoxification process and play some role in inhibiting cancer formation. Now, I'm not gonna get into all that sciencey details here, but just know that these broccoli um, sprouts can be very beneficial. Uh, again, liver detoxification and helping destroy cancer cell formation. So the cruciferous vegetables are ubiquitous. They're everywhere. They're really healthy for us and they can be very beneficial in our health and they're low carb. So there you have it. 
Um, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please share it with a friend. They'll thank you for it. And I will see you in the next video.